Hey guys, Marshall Monkey here, presenting my The Flash Season 1, Episode 8 review. I actually did this already, put it up on my channel for a whole day. Yeah, um, it kind of had a glitch, and I hate glitches, so it had a little thumbnail problem. And instead of fixing it, I tried to fix it over and over and over again. I tried everything, looked up everything that I could on the thumbnail problem. I just ended up deleting it all together. So let's just go again. Oh my gosh, amazing episode. Greatness, greatness all around, just like Christmas time. Seriously, so let's get started with this. Um, I don't think Rainbow Raider, Rainbow Raider was the villain of the episode. Don't think he was the main um, story this time. Obviously because it was a crossover, but definitely of the big drop name drops that are coming. All the big stuff that happened. So, um... Let's just go over everything. Definitely love the crossover. I definitely love the training session. Eddie versus the Flash. Um, Iris not feeling her at all. She was definitely my least favorite character of the episode. Just because she's the only one in the show that doesn't know what's going on. And I hate that. Kind of like Thea was for the longest time. Like Laurel was kind of getting onto it. But then Thea was always just like annoying. Thea is going to have a bigger story this time, but we need to get back to that story. We need to get back to her becoming someone. Like, I want to see her fight Arrow. Wouldn't that be cool? Like, seriously. Um, but I don't think it's going to happen. I think that's going to go a different route with her character's training and all that. Mia Dearden, Mia Dearden, hopefully. Um, so, yeah. And then, basically, we have a lot of drops, like I said, in this episode of The Flash. We have Connor Hawk. This kind of confused me for a second when Oliver was in the coffee shop, Jitters, when he was in there, and he and this lady came up. I didn't know who she was at first, but then when she talked to the kid on the phone, she's, and if you remember, she's the girl who has Oliver's child, and it's really awesome, and I think Connor Hawk is coming. Um, maybe soon, maybe like a different season, or maybe like soon. I don't think they would drop a big thing like that in Central City with her being there. And then, like, not have a flashback or not remind anybody without putting Connor Hawk in the story. I definitely think that he's coming. Due to the due to the years that's gone by, he's definitely probably eight, maybe nine. Wouldn't that be cool if we had a pre-Connor Hawk running around? Kind of like we have with Gotham, like a pre-Batman with Bruce Wayne. I know that's a little bit different, but still, wouldn't that be so cool? Like, I think it would be an awesome... Um, Thing that they could do with the story and all that, so yeah, okay. And then, anyway, another big drop is the firestorm. Um, Robbie Amell is back, uh, he looks a little different because obviously he has that Martin Stein in his, in his brain, uh, insane in the membrane, you know what I'm talking about? So, he has all that in there, so he's a little weird right now. I definitely think that once he comes back to Central City, he'll be all cray, I and mean, then, like, you know, um. You know, kind of like fix him up, you know, like with his mind or whatever. So, yeah, I don't think that's what's going to happen um, for that. But, yeah, Rainbow Raider is gone. Everyone's gone, like, for Rainbow, for the villains right now. No new villain yet until the next week's Reverse Flash. I'm so excited that I can hardly wait. Um, so, yeah, we're going to be getting that. And, yeah, that's basically all that's coming up out, out of this now. Um, so yeah, I mean, there's some Easter eggs out for the episode, like I said, with Palmer Technology sign that was there, um, for that building that you guys don't, like, if you guys remember that, that was pretty cool. So yeah, but overall, great episode, I definitely think that this is gonna be awesome, so I'm gonna be doing my Arrow video today as well, uh, I just had to redo this one because of the thumbnail problem, and hopefully this video won't, um, have that problem. So yeah, thanks guys, and Twitter and Instagram links down below, and see you later, bye-bye.